Right, I'm here at uh, Planet Fitness. I'm here now with uh, Nathan Cleverley. How's it going, Nath? Going very well, mate. Very well. Feeling positive. Just under uh, three weeks to go. How, how's training and stuff been going? Yeah, training's gone well. We're three weeks away from fight now. Well, two and a half weeks now, as we speak. Um, it's gone well. You know, I've had a long training camp for this, um, and I've had to. You know, biggest fight of my life, you could say. So it's gone really good. I'm happy. I'm in a good place. Feeling good. Um, ready. I'm ready. Yeah. Um, you both seem to hate each other a lot, Knife. Um, is this just for ticket sales or is this a real thing? Um, no, we, we dislike each other a lot. You know, he hates me, he wants, he wants to punch my head in. He absolutely wants to hurt me bad. It's just a shame he can't, because I'm going to stop him. Um, I'm going to stop him from hurting me. I've prepared well. Um, and he, he does, he, he hates me, you know, he's still bitter from the first fight, because I obviously won the first fight in Liverpool, um, I was 24 years of age, going into his own town, and I won the fight, he's still bitter from that, he's bitter from that, and the fact that I was the main light heavyweight under Frank Warren at the time, he hates that. Be be and before the build-up of the first fight, he seemed to hate you then? He, yeah, he, he hated me. He's hated me all the way along, you could say, you know, because I was always in his way. I was his big rival, you know, I had the titles that he wanted. I was the number one light heavyweight in the Frank Warren stable, and he wanted that position. So he hated me for that, you know, because <laughs> that's the type of person he is, you know, and I, I dislike him, I just dislike him, I just hate the way he looks, I hate, I hate the way he sounds, the way he talks, the way he mouths off. I, I just dislike a lot about that guy, and... We, we're going to settle the score on the 22nd of November. Uh, can you take anything from the first fight going into this fight? Uh, the first fight, can I take anything? Well, apparently he's, he's become this big massive puncher now. He's a cruiserweight. You know, in, in, in the first fight there was, there was no problem. You know, he caught me clean in that fight and there was no impact. So, from, from his reputation and, and the way people are making out now, he's this King Kong punch in the cruiserweight division. Yeah, maybe maybe I'll have to respect that, and and and, and uh, I'll, I'll I'll soon find out. I'll soon find out on the twenty second. Do you think the new weight will be more suited to you or suited to him? I think we're both better at the weight, in all fairness. You know, I think we're both better cruiserweights. I think he, you know, he's performed well in his first couple of fights. Um, I feel strong. You know, power punching, punching nice now, nice and crisp and and hard. So I think we'll both be better. I think it'll be a, a similar version of the first fight, but a more explosive version. You fought twice now at this weight. Do you, do you feel better for it? Yeah, I feel better. I feel better. I just more energy now. You know, I, uh, towards the end of the light heavyweight, I started. I wouldn't say struggling to make the weight, but I was, it was starting to affect my performance. You know, I, I, I didn't feel. I just didn't feel 100% lack of energy. My legs would go heavy. My mouth would go dry because I was weight drained towards the end. Definitely better now, yeah. loving it. And uh, do you have a prediction for this fight? Prediction is, I think it'll be a good fight while it lasts. I don't think it'll go 12 rounds, nor at this weight. I think something's got to give. But I believe I can, I believe I can break Tony Bellew up and, and, and get this guy out late on. And what will it mean to you to win this fight now? Well, it's, it's um, losing is not an option for this fight. It's not an option. I can't, I can't, I can't let this guy beat me, you know. He's, one day or the last of it, so I need I need to win this guy. You know, I need to finish it and settle the score at cruiserweight, make it 2-0 repeat and silence, silence him once and for all. I'm not looking past this fight, but um, what, you know, what would you like next? Any fights in the division you'd like? Yeah, well, um, I've, I've not really thought too much about it because this is such a big fight and we need to, we need to get this one done, but you know, there's talk of the winner fighting Marco Huck, who Who's, who said he, he he would like to fight the winner? So that's another massive fight, and that's a that's a carrot for the winner, um, and that's a big um, you know it's a big thing. It's a ma well, a massive thing to fight for the world title, you know. So big reward made for the winner. Yeah. And then before we go, have you got any final words, mate? Final words to to the fight fans, probably. I got few words to the fight fans for those intrigued on the fight tune in on fight night you know it's um it's going to be a explosive fight this you know it's a great fight we 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 dislike each other outside the ring we're going to carry that into the ring it's going to be a fiery fight and 
a lot of emotions going to be on the line. I think it's going to be an excellent fight. So to the guys tune in, enjoy it, and to all my fans, true fans, um, keep supporting me. Appreciate it. And ready to do the biz on the 22nd. All the other, all the other boxing fans from around the world, how can they follow you? Nate? Social media? Yeah, for all the other um, fight fans around the world and anybody who's interested in following me, yeah, social media on Twitter at Nathan Clev. Um, my Facebook is, is too busy now at the moment. I can't, I can't add any more friends on. Have that, you so. got a like page on there? Well, uh, yeah, I've got a like page on on Facebook. So Facebook, Twitter, uh, Twitter is the main one now. Yeah. Right then, Nath, I uh, appreciate you taking time out to talk to me. Cheers, buddy. Wish you all the best, fight night, and uh, hopefully catch up with you soon. Tiger.